So let's get started here with our Stingray live demo webinar. Thank you for joining us. Um, today we're just going to take 15 minutes. It's really all you'll need to learn everything you need to know about the Stingray. Um, I'm joined here by Nicole, one of our account managers. Hi guys. So my name is Ryan, I'm the director of marketing here, and um, we're going to jump right in. And let's go. So today we're gonna to give a quick overview. You're going to get to meet the Stingray, talk about some of the accessories that are involved, some of the main features of this product. We will go through the install and setup, talk about some of the room versatility options, and what I really want you to take away from this webinar today is what problem that this Stingray solves. Okay, you guys, this is it. This is the Stingray. This is the game changer that is out there now. Um, as you can see, there's a front panel, uh, very simple. And what's great about this, and again, it's like Ryan said, this is about solving big problems that are out there in the industry. And we find those big problems are the time that it takes to go out there and install, the money that it costs, and then there's always like the post install thing going on, right? So you go program these things, and then you gotta go back and tweak it, and it's eating up time and money. This is exactly what that solves, okay? On the back side here, you can see the Phoenix connectors. I'm not gonna go through the details of all this because we'll hit those, those marks along the way, but everything that you can program on our GUI to set this up, you can do right there on the front of this panel. Perfect, all right, let's jump in. So here we're just gonna talk about some of the accessories and we're gonna go through all of this in, in a little bit of detail. So if you have any questions, Go ahead and ask them, we'll address them at the end. Um, on the left here, we have the MT720. This is an XLR adapter. We've had a lot of partners out there that have requested this because they have microphones with XLR connectors. So we gave you an accessory. Simple, easy peasy. Right, and over here we have our Phoenix Connect application. You'll see that this is available on really all platforms, whatever you're using in your conference room, um, whether it's a tablet on the table, um, you know, a desktop a computer, you are able to download this application and directly from it, you can do all of these things. You know, this just really makes it very simple for you to conduct a meeting with like seamless integration. You can upload contacts directly to it. You can dial straight from it. You mute the room. You combine and split rooms directly from this app. It really just makes your meetings a lot easier to conduct. It's so intuitive. It's just easy, you guys. Okay, so. Now we're gonna bring the heat. We're gonna talk about features and we're gonna get specific here. We're gonna talk about the daisy chaining of the Stingray. We're gonna talk about zoning or flex rooms, uh, the bridging and how seamless it is. Uh, we'll talk about the unique line inputs, built-in PA, and you guys, no programming. I'm telling you, I can set this thing up and that's saying something. I am not a techie girl, okay? So let's get down to daisy chaining. Daisy chaining, you can do up to 15 of these together. Okay, it's a single ethernet cord, link up, link down, and on the GUI you can decide what you want you, your primary unit to be versus what you want your secondary unit to be. Again, this is something that is so simple, I can have my little niece or nephew do it. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> cool. Okay, so this is just gonna give you an example of different zoning, right? Let's say you have one big gigantic room, you need one smaller section and two medium-sized sections, or maybe you need one small section and one really large section. Whatever you decide to do, it's all you do is go onto the GUI or the front side of that panel of the Stingray and decide what you want to be your primary unit and what you want as your secondary. That simple. Bridging. You guys, you've got your near end and your far end, right? And we've got the secret sauce in between to make this all happen. There is no craziness happening to make all these products work together. We've got SIP, analog, digital, whether you've got your hard codec, whether you're using blue jeans, Skype for Business, Google Hangouts, it doesn't matter. This all just works seamlessly. So if you're on a SIP call and you need to dial in somebody on Skype and ask them a question, it just all happens for you if you need to hang up you use your Skype interface if you need to hang up on your SIP. Like Ryan was explaining, we have an app that just makes it so easy and is very intuitive to use to disconnect and again, re-engage. 
Right, we use this feature every day in our own office. You know, we're on a meeting here, we're doing a video conferencing meeting, and we need to get a hold of someone right outside, uh, whether they're in the warehouse or stuck in traffic on the way here. We just bridge them into the call, and you don't have to you know, do something separately. You know, what's great about this is you also, you on the far end can hear the, the, same, uh, the same bridged in call. Um, this is just the seamless um, you know, features of this product. It makes it a lot easier to conduct meetings without thinking about all these extra variables. Yeah, you can focus on your meeting, which is what you're supposed to be doing, not on the units and equipment that sometimes can get complicated and that isn't so easy, right? This, we keep it easy. Yeah. So let's talk about the line, the unique line inputs. Um, you can do voice lift, you can do podium mic here, auxiliary, and there's four uh, unique line inputs. So basically what that means is that it comes in after the mixing, okay? So it's, it's not getting mixed, it's not gonna do beam forming, it's just that direct line input. Um, you also have a built-in PA. Uh, basically those are for your speakers, and there are eight ohms, uh, 15 watts, and you have two pairs of stereo options there for you. All right, this is our web GUI. This really just speaks again to this plug and play aspect. Um, you know, you can see the simplicity right here on the screen. You're going to, now I want to reiterate that you can do everything you need to do on the front panel of the Stingray. You don't need to jump directly to this GUI, but it's you know, a feature to give you the options to adjust speaker sensitivity, to uh, split rooms. You know, it gives you a few more of those, uh, those options here directly on the GUI just by inputting the IP address of your Stingray. It takes you right on to the web browser and you can do it directly from here. So actually, before you switch screens, I just want to address a couple things. Because I mean, the whole point of why we're here is to talk about what problems this solves, right? right. So with your DSPs out there, look, Crestron and, and uh, Biamp, I mean, like they kill the game when it comes to these DSPs, right? We're not trying to like be better than them. They're great. But we're just trying to change it up, right? Because you get those conference rooms, and they're your typical conference rooms that are four speakers, four microphones in the ceiling. You just need a mixer for it. And this is it. And what's beautiful about this is that you'll be certified in seven minutes, okay? All you do is decide what you want your sensitivities to be. It's really easy. I can do it. Again, that's saying a lot. <laughs> and, uh, you, you know, a lot of our partners, um, they charge maybe like an hour or two of programming for the Stingray, which is pure profit to them amongst the margins and things that they're making on top of that. And there's no post-install problems. This is something you don't need to have somebody on staff for to certify, you know, as certified or anything else. It is just easy. It solves the problem. You can get on to doing more jobs and making more money, which I think is the bottom line, and resting assured that you're providing and installing a product that is very, very high quality audio. You're gonna hear us say this a million times. We say plug and play. We say set it, forget it. Um, and this really just harps on the fact that this is a simple to install and easy to use DSP mixer. And I think you're seeing that right here today. Um, you know, this is the versatility and scalability of how our products fit into these different environments. You know, as you see up here, we're looking at your average conference room. This can really just uh, be used with one Stingray, use four, four mics, and that works perfectly in that room. But then with the same Stingray, you have you know, daisy chain options, you have split room options, and then it still works in these other environments. You have a split room here. We also have a very large conference room up in the other corner, and you just have to daisy chain units and set it and forget it. That's it. You guys, this is the current DSP world. This is what I'm talking about. Biamp, Crestron, you've got uh, Tessiera, I didn't even say that right, whatever. All complicated, it's all complicated. And don't get me wrong, because you need these complicated DSPs out there for your very complicated rooms that need customization. We are not trying to wipe that world out, but that just isn't our world. And this is what's been the game changer here at Phoenix Audio Technologies with the Stingray. Yeah, what does our world look like? This is what our world looks like. Totally simple. It's really not that complicated. It's not, we brought the fire guys. Well, there you go. In uh, less than 15 minutes, we gave you a look at the Stingray DSP mixer. Um, now, I definitely want to encourage you to ask questions. Please send them in. We'll answer you directly after this webinar has concluded.
But I really want to thank you for attending. If you have more questions, you can go directly to phnxaudio.com or you can connect directly with Nicole. Nicole, how can they contact you? If you guys want to drink that Kool-Aid, you are welcome to contact me at Nicole, that's N-I-C-O-L-E, M as in Mary, at phnxaudio.com or you're welcome to call me direct at 818-937-4774. Okay, give them that phone number one more time as they grab a pen and paper. Yeah, for sure. It's 818-937-4774. All right, guys. That's it. Thanks, Thanks you guys. It was so fun. Have a great one. Bye.